Hey guys, this is Cody, and uh, this is going to be kind of a special video today. Um, this is mostly going to be sort of a thank you video, and it's going to be me talking a lot about, you know, how long I've been on YouTube and, you know, what's happened to me since I started my YouTube channel. So, you know, it's going to be kind of an overview of, you know, me being on YouTube and what it means to be to be part of this awesome community and to be, you know, um, just part of the whole movie community and part of this awesome thing. And the main reason why I'm doing it today is because tomorrow is actually my 21st birthday. And, um, yeah, so now that I'm 21, I'm starting to reflect on a lot of things that, you know, have gone on in my life. You know, all the good stuff and all the bad things. You know, that's, uh, that's one thing that I think that people do uh, on their birthday. They always go back and they always think about what happened, you know, what what they've been through in their life. And then, you know, they see how far they've come. And um, I, I thought that it'd be fun to do that on here and talk a bit about, you know, what it's been like to, you know, be on YouTube. But before I do that, I actually want to do a shout out to a cool friend of mine who I met on YouTube. Um, he was commenting on my videos a lot, and then he sent me a, a friend request on Facebook, and his name is, uh, let me see, Black Ninja 847 So yeah, if you guys want to uh, check out his channel, I'll leave a link down below. He's a really nice guy. He, uh, like I said, he added me on Facebook a couple days ago, and we've just been talking a lot. He's a really big horror fan. Um, he's in he's in a couple of uh, Facebook groups that I'm in, and he posts a lot of really cool stuff. He really doesn't have a lot of subscribers now, so if you guys, you know, uh, it'd be really great if you guys could check out his uh, channel, and if you guys like it, uh, you know, just subscribe to him. And if not, then, you know, feel free to, you know, at least like his videos or leave a comment down below. You know, I mean, I'm, I know that he would really appreciate it, and, you know, it's just... Uh, you know, which is a great way to, you know, help somebody out, you know, of course, you know, I'm, I already subscribed to so many people, so, uh, you know, I'm not subscribing to anybody anymore, but, you know, if I could, I would, and, um, you know, of course, I'll be liking his videos and checking them out every once in a while, so, you know, if you, uh, you know, like what you see, just go, just go on down below and check out his channel, because he's a really nice guy, and I think he deserves more subscribers. Uh, the next thing I'm going to be doing, um, I'm actually going to be showing off a pre-birthday sort of mail day. Uh, I actually ordered this movie about a week ago, and I was expecting it to get here on my birthday, and it ended up arriving to me Saturday. And it's one movie that I've been wanting to see for a really long time, and I'm so glad to finally have it in my collection. And that is Let Sleeping Corpses Lie. Um, this is the single disc DVD from Blue Underground, with that really, really nice cover. And, um, yeah, like I said, I've been wanting to see this movie for a really long time. Um, I've, I posted, you know, some pics of this in, in different groups I'm in, and everyone has said that it's, it's a flawless, just one of the best zombie films. And, you know, I've, I've heard about it for years, so I'm really glad that I finally have this in my collection. I was um, looking at the, uh, the two-disc special edition of the movie, uh, and I was thinking about maybe getting that. But, um, it was, well, first off, this was lower, you know, this was a lower price, but also, the, uh, the two-disc edition, it uses the title, The Living Dead at the Manchester Morgue, and it uses a different cover, and I honestly, I prefer the Let Sleeping Corpses Lie cover, and I really love that artwork to the movie right there. I think it just looks so creepy, you know, it's, you know, this is definitely one movie that, you know, you would see at, a you know, at an old movie store, an old VHS, and get really, really creeped out. If I was younger then this cover would probably creep me out but um you know like i said i want to see it for a really long time and i'm really glad to finally have it well that is it that is just my uh you know little pickup that i got i have another movie coming in um in the mail soon and i've also got a re really really big uh dvd update i'm gonna be doing after my birthday um, I'm not going to show off anything um, uh, until this until probably Monday or so, and the reason why is because all my uh, most of my birthday gifts are over at my mom's, and we're going to be celebrating this coming up weekend because she's working on my birthday, which is tomorrow. So we'll be uh, celebrating then, and I'll get all my presents in. So I just wanted to show that off right now, so it doesn't I don't forget, and I don't have like I won't have as much to show off on my actual uh, birthday update. 
So anyway, um, yeah, so like I said, this was sort of like a thank you to everybody and sort of me reflecting on my, uh, you know, on my channel. So I just recently checked uh, my subscribers and I have over uh, 260, I believe. I think I have more now. And it's just absolutely awesome to know that that many people enjoy watching my videos and enjoy just you know enjoy just watching just watching me you know it's it's a great feeling to know that all those people do um when i first started youtube i you know i posted short videos about me you know uh just doing collections and showing off all my movies and showing off my collectibles and i remember from the first maybe couple of months i didn't get a single subscriber and after and you know I wasn't just doing it just to get subscribers I was doing it because I wanted to show off my collection you know because when I was younger and you know I was in school like elementary school and middle school nobody in my schools nobody that I knew liked horror stuff as much as I did or collected stuff or collected movies so ever since I was really young I always felt really left out in some sort of way I felt I don't want to say weird because I like this stuff and I and you know it was what I and that's who I was but at the same time I just felt like I wasn't I couldn't find anybody to, con to connect to I couldn't I there wasn't anybody around me that shared my hobby of collecting and my hobby of films as much as me of course I had friends that enjoy watching movies but it wasn't anything like the way I do so of course so when I found out that people uploaded videos about their collections on YouTube, I immediately wanted to start doing it. And um, I automatically enjoyed it right off the back. Of course I wasn't as great on videos as I am now, but I really did start enjoying it and it used to be really fun for me. And once I started getting my first couple subscribers, that just helped, that just boosted me up. And it made me start to feel like I was a part of something. Now that I have over 200, I think it's over 200 now, it might be more. I keep forgetting how many subscribers I actually have now. But um, now that I have so many subscribers now, I really do feel like I am a part of something big, you know. And I met so many amazing people, so many amazing horror fans, and people that just sit around and just watch, you know, movies and just enjoy them and live them, basically. And I do feel like I am a part of this amazing, great community. And, you know, it makes me feel really good inside and to know that I just I feel this way. You know, I don't feel like that, that weird kid, you know, that nobody wanted to talk to because all I talked about was movies all the time. You know, that, you know, the weird kid that would rather pre pretend that he was an episode of uh, Power Rangers than he would go and Hank play with other kids, you know. That's what I used to do. I used to act out like movies and stuff when I was a little kid or whatever, just playing around in playgrounds and stuff at school. And, you know, now I'm actually around a ton of people that, you know, they probably felt the same way. They probably felt like outcasts when they were in school, you know, when they were younger, because I'm sure that, you know, there are, there are so many people in the movie community. There are, like, thousands of people. But then there are also so many other people that don't even know it exists. And, of course, when you tell somebody that doesn't understand that, they look at you like, oh, you sit around and watch movies all day, you know, or, oh, you collect this, that's, you know, and it's so hard to explain to them, well, you know, this is how, this is who I am, this is what I do, this is what I enjoy, I'm going to continue doing this because it's just, it's something that I've always enjoyed. And the fact that I am just, you know, I'm almost 21 now, like I said, and the fact that I am in this awesome community, it makes me feel really great. You know, I, I get a lot of self-confidence when I do my reviews. Like when I do these videos and you guys give me positive feedback, you have no idea what that means to me. That makes my day sometimes. You know, whenever I see a comment, like, great, great review, man. It really means a lot. I'm sure everybody that does YouTube, you know, feels the same way and can relate to this. And I'm really, you know, I, I'm glad that we are all... Right now, we're all in a great community, and we all care about each other, and we'll support each other. I know that there are, of course, some channels of people that are just, you know, they just make them just to make fun of movies and make fun of people that are a part of it.
But that's probably only because they were never really a part of the community in the first place, and they just wanted to talk shit about everybody. And, you know, for those people, you guys, you know, you guys just won't understand it. And, um, you know, for the people that aren't in the community and don't really understand why we do this, you know, I always try to explain to them, like, my cousin Spencer, let's say he was a big fan of Pokemon, so to him, I would explain to it as, oh, well, it's like you with your Pokemon cards. You know, you love collecting them, or Yu-Gi-Oh, you know. You love collecting those, and that's how I felt about collecting movies. You know, I, I gotta get the next one. I gotta get the next, oh, the super rare one. Oh, I gotta get that. Oh, the cover. Oh, that looks awesome. You know what I mean? And my cousin, you know, he's always supported me. You know, he, he's not into YouTube or whatever, but he always, you know, he just always, you know, has supported me and has never talked down to me. So that's the way I would sort of describe to people, or maybe... People who collect baseball cards, you know, you might, that might be a good way of describing it. But, um, yeah, guys, this video's probably gone on for a bit long, but, uh, this is basically just me saying thank you to everybody who has subscribed to me. Thanks to all you who are friends with me on Facebook, you know, who has commented on my videos, who's liked my videos, who's done video responses. Just thank you all so much. You guys have actually taking me out of a, a depression I had. I was really depressed in middle school and even in high school. You know, I've been depressed for a long, long time now. And um, ever since I started doing YouTube, it's gotten less and less. And now I, I barely get depressed anymore. And it's because of this. So thank you all so much for, you know, liking, commenting, subscribing, talking to me. It really means a lot. Um, and I'll be thinking about you all tomorrow, you know, when I'm celebrating my birthday. I'm not going to be on YouTube, so if I, don't, uh, if I don't respond to any comments tomorrow, it's because I'm going to be gone all day, having fun with my friends, and just living it up, you know, 21. And um, I must say, I, I could not be happier. So, like I said, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing. Check out the link down below to Mike's channel, he's a really nice guy. I'll be sure to upload a whole video of everything I get for my birthday. Hopefully this coming up Monday. I've got some cool reviews I've got planned. And I uh, can't wait to show you guys. So thanks once again for everybody watching. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.